Hi, I'm just going to show a quick demo of my new system called Beam Grid that lets you control the your mouse on Linux using your voice. And so it's it's got a speech recognition system in Windows running Dragon naturally speaking that's using Anaya to remotely control my Linux desktop. And normally Anaya can be used to control the keyboard but not the mouse. And so using my new thing, you'll be able to control the mouse. So I'll try it now. Beam. Char J Julia. Beam. Zero three. Beam. So if I just pause here and show the grid, um, it's made up of two symbols. So for example, here it's got N, K, and my mappings I've set it up because Dragon has trouble with my voice I have to say a special code word for each letter so I say nasal instead of N and I say crife instead of K and that way if I wanted to click here I could say nasal crife and um, if you look along here it's it's actually made up of say the numbers 0 to 9 and then the alphabet for English and then a bunch of symbols that are on the keyboard and that way you get a large number of different possible things to say using a keyboard but I've also extended it to have Unicode symbols for here example it's got music, note, flag, triangle, square, etc. So by using the addition of those it lets you have fairly fine-grained control across the screen just by using two words and I'm, I'll show examples of that Beam. I'll turn the microphone on. Beam. Char Cryf. Beam. Zero three. Beam. Two Foxy. Beam. Remo minus. Beam. Itchy two. Beam. Pound one, beam, cryf minus. I've also set up a few different ways that I can not just do a left mouse click, but can do other things. Obviously, things like right mouse click and also mouse wheel, but um, sometimes I'll want to select specific letters on the screen and I'm the current beam system I made, it's not fine-grained enough to do that because it's basically the width of two characters. But I've also set up a mode that it can select one character width at a time. So um, I'll show examples of that. And I'll show um, if I've got for starting that. So um, glide means to go along the x-axis and sync means to go along the y-axis. So, for example, um, if I wanted to grab just here that it says show mouse grid, I, I'll show an example of that. So, let's say if we started already on the line, we'll show glide, glide, zemisi, drag, glide, minus, release, control char, Beam, three itchy, control video. So that just selected just the parts show mouse grid and then paste, copied it and then pasted it over here. And I'll, I've also set up a, a mode ladder that it lets you choose first along X and then Y. Um, and because it's one dimensional each time, you can choose it. Um, fine grand enough to be one character at a time and that's actually because I've I'm using a relatively large font on my screen and it, it's all a fixed width and height so I've, I've found the width and height of each character on my, in my font and then I've put it into this script so then the font that it displays will be the same width and height of my whole system font so I'll just show a demo of that Jeez. 
Lara, Zemisi, Tolasan, Lara, Zemisi, Yelax, Drag, Glide, Minus, Release. So that was an example of moving the mouse up to a specific character and then moving, dragging it across and releasing. And um, sometimes it's the mouse point will be slightly off, so there's also the nudge mode. So if I say nudge north, nudge northeast, nudge northeast 50. So that lets you move it in, a, in sort of a, um, the most common directions and to specify distance and you can also specify sort of a, a mouse click at the end of it or show the different mouse clicks that are enabled. Um, so these different modes it's got. So there's kick. Um, these are very similar to the caster system and um, the, the grid mode I've set up, it's actually based on Douglas Grid, which is part of Casta, but that only runs on Windows, whereas this runs on Linux. So it has kick for less left mouse click and side kick for right mouse click. Then you can move the mouse wheel up and down using high or low, and obviously the drag and release that we mentioned, and, and also double clicking and triple clicking.